lighting is done with our time of day lighting system. So you can see uh, where the sun should rise and uh, you can see how, how bright it is and what type of fog settings you can have, 0.5 maybe. So with all this set up and almost just one mouse click, you, you build your little forest. It's not so fast. You build your little forest and you can you can move around certain elements, rotate them, and make basically the forest as, as dense as you want to have. Then on the ground, there's obviously right now there's grass. Let's turn on the procedural vegetation. So this is, uh, these are distribute, distributed uh, objects based on the um, ground coverage. For example, for example, if I paint the forest texture, I define within the vegetation system there should be little plants growing, growing on them. Also, you might, you might notice um, the shadows are updating in real time. They are really yeah, smooth, soft shadows. So even though they are real time, there's not a disadvantage using them. The terrain modification, we get uh, different tools, for example, uh, the normal terrain sculpting tool is like here, you, you modify the height map and you can say, oh, I want to have it this high, oh, I, I want to cut in here some mountain and it, uh, the shading obviously get also up 